Hello everybody, this is Ricky He. Before we go on, what I'm about to talk about, I'd like to thank each and every one of y'all who subbed to my channel, and I finally reached 202. Let's go past 200, and go to like, let's say, 900 subscribers. If we can do that. Or actually, let's go a little bit higher than that. All right. Now I'm gonna say this, if you're new to the channel and you've been liking my react videos, on my shorts, on my live streams, when I'm on, all right, oh, I got burp, excuse me, okay, um, do me one thing, uh, do me one thing, please, hit the like button, uh, give the subscribe button a big old bear hug. I slap that notification bell and share this with your friends and tell everybody you love them. Okay, so here we go. Now, what we're going to be talking about, there's a guy calling himself Call of Shame. I'm sure everybody's heard of them. A lot of you probably never have. Okay? Let me get with this. Okay? When you're playing Warzone, Fortnite, Fall Guys, Overwatch, or any games like that, you do know you're having somebody watching you. Right? It could be me being watched, or it could be you being watched and here's what he does or any other so-called hacker killers and this is what's running the gaming community I believe what he does what they do and what y'all don't understand and this is a problem right here with a lot of people they worship this guy they call him God Almighty and at one time, I have read on his comments, he said, hey, everybody, it's your God Almighty returning back. Okay. And then his intro, it's not all that great. He, his intro, when you watch it, it shows the kick-ass movie part of, of that girl. And he's too afraid to show his face. That shows you he's a fake. So. Now. Problem what I'm about to say right here is. He goes on there. He picks on these big top streamers. Alright. He puts stuff on their screen. I don't know how he does it. But he puts stuff on the streamer's screen to make it look like they're cheating. Okay? I don't know how he does it or what it what not. But um It's gotta be stopped. Because I don't know why someone like him, who is the villain and the bad guy. And there's a loads of people that's been trying to have this guy removed. Call of Shame for years. Since he started this. And if you look on his profile on YouTube about him, it says he's from uh, United Kingdom. That part I do not believe. That is not where he's from. He's doing that to cover his identity. Because he, he or she don't want to show herself. Because they could be someone on Warzone that's hacking and cheating. And who no, nobody knows. I mean, I know a lot of y'all probably not going to like this video, but this has got to be, this has got to be in the wide open. It's got to be. Can't keep this hidden no more of how much this bothers me in the commu gaming community. Call of Shame, Grandpa Hacks, and whoever the other hacker killers are. 
They got to go. They have to be canceled. All their platforms. Even the ones who is tr planning on trying to do the same thing got to be stopped while they're ahead. Because it's getting too toxic. Because Call of Shame is picking on the same people every day and every week. Picking on swag. Hell, for a while he's picking on Expel, and he's not even a popular streamer yet, but he's been aiming at him. Who's next? Me? You? I mean, I know a lot of you don't want to hear this, but I just wanted to get this out in the wide open. Call of Shame is a bad person. He's going around calling himself God. He's literally a bad person. He or she. And anyone else that's liking this, calling themselves the so-called hacker killers like Grandpa Hacks on all them, who are they going to target next? That's what you need to be thinking at. And you're not even cheating. But they find some way on their computer or whatnot, get on your, on your stream, when you're streaming, put wall hacks and stuff like that on your chat on your screen people believe you are cheating to me a super fucking cringe man I mean I who does this guy think he is well cause he's what got 500,000 subscribers or what not and then he all of a sudden thinking he's a uh, Above everybody. Dude don't even care about his viewers. Really? All he wants is their money. Just putting out content just to make himself look good. He's too afraid to show his face. He or she. I don't know because Call of Shame is showing showing up. Showing just a pit, uh, an intro of the girl off a of kick ass. I mean, to me, honestly, that is not a legit person. I just someone who just wants to get their self known, but in the wrong way. He's good now. <clears throat> now. You know the war is all ranked, right? I'm not going to say nothing about Rara, but now they're going. He's going on there, and after he said that he was the one that said is that Call of Shame is going after Expel now. After he didn't get his way with other streamers, now he's going to pick on smaller streamers. And now Rara is doing the same thing. After he said he's not steeping in Call of Shame's level. And now he's doing the same thing. Because he's picking on one player on Warzone rank. Funksy. And saying he's cheating. Now come on now. And now he's going around and saying that 250 people that's on right are cheating. I'm just telling you. I mean, ain't nothing wrong with Rara. But he said he would not steep in Call of Shame's level. And he already is. I mean... Dude, call of shame, has been harassing streamers for years. And nobody's even tried to stop him from doing that. Nobody's even tried stopping him from doing that. Harassing streamers. And that's when that, what, what I'm saying right now. People need to get their shit together and ban this guy 
off all platforms. Not just here on YouTube. We're talking about like Twitch, Twitter, Instagram. What other platforms? Kick, Rumble, whatever else. Facebook. Now, the dude's got to be stopped because he is running the gaming community. You can't have no fun unless that dude is watching you and then he's going to make a video of you and saying that you are cheating. Now, if, if you agree with me on here, let me know in the comments below what you think needs to be done of Call of Shame, Grandpa Hacks, or anyone else who's trying to be like them. That's about all I want to talk about. Alright, see ya.